Hello, this is Virgil Labrador, Editor-in-Chief of Satellite Markets and Research, and we're here at the ETL Systems booth in Amsterdam, the Netherlands, at IBC 2015 with Andrew Bond. He's the uh, Sales Director, Global Sales Director for uh, ETL Systems. Uh, this is the first time we're having ETL Systems uh, in this uh, videocast, so Andrew, welcome to this uh, videocast. Thanks, Virgil. It's nice to see you on the stand. And you're always welcome to interview us anytime you see us at these shows. Thank you, thank you, Andrew. My, my, it's my pleasure to be here. How's the show going for you? We've had a, a great three days. Uh, it was fantastic to see on Friday morning lines and lines of people mm -hmm. outside the IBC mm -hmm. um, uh, visitor registration. So it's it's an event that's well attended, and we always like coming to support IBC. Right. Now, for the benefit of our viewers who are not too familiar with the company, can you give a brief overview of what you do? The heart of what we do is in RF distribution mm -hmm. for satellite signals mm -hmm. coming into satellite teleports, mm -hmm. whether they are uh, for broadcasters mm -hmm. or governments, or even for small teleports in uh, the oil and gas industry. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're very diverse, we're very flexible, and we've got a, a, big, a big range of products which uh, carry these signals uh, that come out of the dishes and distribute them into the teleports. Right. Can you be specific of the different product lines that you have? Um, the usual product lines you'll see uh, that deliver these signals mm -hmm. uh, will naturally be uh, uh, splitters, mm -hmm. uh, redundancy switches, mm -hmm. um, L-band and IF amplifiers, mm -hmm. uh, and running into uh, matrices, L-band and IF matrices, right. which uh, then go on to deliver signals into uh, modems and IRDs right. that we all know, know well that decode the signal. Right. And you mentioned teleports. Who, who are your other customers uh, for the, your products? Well, we tend to work very closely with a lot of the satellite operators mm -hmm. because they demand uh, very high quality signals mm -hmm. and we do a, a degree of redundancy switching for them and also carrier monitoring mm -hmm. to make sure that they know what's going on, what traffic is going on on their satellite fleet. Right. Uh, the other customers tend to be professional broadcasters mm -hmm. and really at the heart of it is the news and sports industry. Right. So football is a huge driver of, of our traffic. Oh. Uh, it's delivering a huge amount of revenue mm -hmm. uh, and it's something that has to be very reliable because mm -hmm. it's um, shifting a signal to millions of people mm -hmm. uh, around the country. Right. And here in the show itself specifically, are you uh, highlighting, showcasing any specific product or products? Uh, we've launched um, a new range of RF over fiber a year ago mm -hmm. uh, called Stingray. Mm -hmm. I'm pleased to say that in a few minutes time uh, we're going to have our first um, Stingray cocktails, mm -hmm. so I uh, hope you'll join us for that. Oh, I'd uh, love version. to, I'd love to. <laughs> um, but uh, that particular product has is really built on the R uh, ETL brand, so we're, we're very familiar with delivering uh, satellite signals, but RF mm -hmm. over fiber is a natural addition to our range. Right. And we're able to deliver um, uh, L-band signals up to 10 kilometers over a fiber optic cable, mm -hmm. and we've got a, a huge uh, and a growing range of modules which uh, help with redundancy, control, mm -hmm. amplification. It's all about reliability, and it's all about delivering a, a, a good quality signal uh, that our customers can trust. Right, right. Are th these are the, the, the sting rates right here. So when will this be? Will this come out? Um, these particular modules we see behind you mm -hmm. are new to the show. Mm -hmm. uh, they're redundancy modules, so mm -hmm. uh, if there is a failure on a particular port, right. you, it automatically goes to a, a, a standby. Right. So we're looking at single points of failure for teleports right. uh, and making sure that if there is a, a problem right. on a downlink, right. that we're not only telling them that there's a problem, but also that we're going to a backup path. And that's right. all peace of mind. Um, right. Now I see you and your team all over the world, uh, from Latin America to Asia, North America, Middle East. Uh, so you, you pretty much cover the whole world? We try and cover the whole world and mm -hmm. um, you travel nearly as much as the uh, ETL sales team do. Um, but like satellite, um, satellite is global and mm -hmm. therefore ETL Systems is global as well. Right. Um, so in the last couple of years we have strengthened our uh, United States office with mm -hmm. um, uh, a new sales team working in uh, Latin America right. um, and also we've strengthened our um, Middle East market with a, an office in Dubai. Mm -hmm. So really it's about providing uh, 
local support, not just sales, but also mm -hmm. um, spare supports and technical solutions mm -hmm. to local customers from both the Middle East, uh, America, and Latin America. Right. You see, uh, we're a market-oriented uh, publication, so among all these markets, which do you see as the great potential for your company? One of the growing ones uh, mm -hmm. that I've been asked about over the last few days mm -hmm. is really the ability for handheld devices to actually receive live content. Mm -hmm. um, and I think we're going to see um, a lot more of the telecom providers become um, uh, traditional satellite teleports uh, mm -hmm. and, and deliver live content themselves, not just right. buy it in. So, we, we're working on a number of programs with, with traditional telecom providers mm -hmm. to actually uh, upgrade uh, their systems to actually receive KU and KA band signals, mm -hmm. turn that into feed and mm -hmm. actually distribute around their mm -hmm. uh, telecoms networks. Right. And so uh, that is a good growth market um, for you know, creating television on the go. Right. Um, and that's, that's good for us uh, as well. Right. Well, Andrew, I think that's a pretty good overview of your company and your products. Uh, is there anything else you'd like to add? Um, no, thank you very much, Virgil. It's always nice to see you, and uh, we'll see you at the next show. Right, likewise. Okay, okay. Thank Andrew. Thank you. And for all the news and information on the global satellite industry, you always have satellite markets and research at www.satellitemarkets.com.